So what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Now, I did a video showing you guys my Truxedo Low Pro bed cover that I added onto the truck. Now, the next thing I want to do to my truck, it's a, kind of a small upgrade, but I want to do it because, gee whiz, every bulb on this truck that I've seen is LED. I mean, even inside the interior, if you look at the headlights, every bulb inside the limited trim package and Longhorn trim package have LED headlights, LED fog lights, turn signals, front and rear. Even the, even the license plate lights that come in the truck have LED lights. When I opened the top compartment up front, I noticed there's an LED right here. And then when I opened this bottom one, I saw that they cheaped out and put an incandescent bulb in there. So we're gonna change that bulb out. Now, actually, I don't know what bulb this is actually, but I'm gonna assume that it's gonna be the same bulbs that they've been using for years. And I'm gonna put my LED bulb in there now. So let's get started. So what I have, this is just my little plying tool I use uh, for all my needs if I need to take off my door panels or something like that, although I haven't done that in so long. I probably wouldn't even attempt to try it on this truck. This this looks pretty, this looks really tight. I'm pretty sure you have to take off this little panel, but this is not what we're talking about today. We're talking about this. So let me go ahead and see if I can pull this off and then I'll show you guys what it looks like when I take it out. So really easy to get this out. All you have to do is just kind of go in at the, where, you, where it curves at the front. You go in right there with this tool and you just kind of put a little bit of pressure to it and it pops out. So this button right here, it turns a light on and off when you close the compartment so all I'm going to do is basically take that bulb out and I have these spare bulbs that I, were, I was using these bulbs in the license plate of my old truck so I kept them and I'm so glad I did because guess what they're gonna be used again in my new Ram truck go figure so let's go ahead and see what it looks like so this is of course what the light looks like now and and this is what the white LED this is basically a crisp white. It should actually, yeah, it matches the LEDs inside the interior really good. But there you go. So I'm gonna go ahead and slip this back in. All you have to do is just, you know, you don't have to jam it in there, you know. Take your time, put it in there nice and neat, and look. Now you have a perfectly nice white light. Now that's gonna be a 194 bulb. Uh, I, I have a ton of these. That I bought for my wife's car, and I think I bought like the last closeout sale that they had of these bulbs. They don't make these bulbs anymore. They actually make a little bit better bulb now. But hey, these were like five bucks, I believe. Actually, I think they're like maybe a little bit cheaper than that. I mean, these are like the, the last bit of them, and yeah, they work really good. They're a nice white crisp LED bulb. I love that the way it looks, and it, as I said, it matches all the other LEDs inside the interior, like up here. So it looks really good in there. So if you want to do some small upgrades, because I'll be honest with you, this truck is so expensive, I can only do things like this. This is this is my ballpark of what I'm going to be doing on my truck. And of course, I use my truck for towing, so I'm not going to lift it four inches and put 40 inch tires on this thing. I mean, I'm, this is actually going to be my work truck in terms of, well, my play truck for our trailer. But there you have it. If you haven't had a chance yet, subscribe to the channel and please like the video. See you in the next one. Later.